Welcome to another weekly episode with me, Matt Peacock from Peacock Landscapes. Uh, today we are planting up this bed that you can see behind me. Uh, this is on a front drive, and we have done. I have done a planting this today uh, under the criteria that um, it's a bit more of a cottagey feel rather than the formal feel, and uh, with a mixture of colours and shapes uh, to come throughout the year, uh, especially in the summer. There's going to be some beautiful plants here. Uh, so I'm going to show you what, um, what we've got going throughout the day and uh, you'll see this turn around in no time at all and we're going to finish it off with uh, some lovely bark chipping, keep the weeds down and uh, it's just about to get nice and wintry and uh, so we've just had all the flooding and at uh, the Barnes Hotel it's all been very well wet and flooded and so next few days here comes the frost so the bark chip is really going to help. Uh, to keep that down, uh, to keep the frost away, and also because we're planting, uh, you know, we want to give the, the plants the best chance possible uh, as they start their life off in this new bed. Okay, so the plants are in place now, and uh, I've put them in uh, various places uh, according to what they are. Now, one of the key principles that we have when doing a cottage style uh, bed, you know, country style, is that you're going to need some anchor points uh, within the bed and for this bed we've got these three box balls surrounded with five lavender now that along with our magnolia in the corner are our two key areas where we've got some anchor points now that allows us to then scatter other plants uh, according to size and uh, height and width um, and color and we have able to scatter them in between and in around and that gives us a lovely look for a country style garden. Okay, so we've uh, planted up now and I'm just gonna talk you through a couple of the things that we've got just on this end of the bed. Uh, we've got some Harishas here, some Palace Purples, a lovely evergreen up in the summer, we've got some lovely uh, body weight to it and some um, beautiful flowers coming through from it. Uh, into some Spirea Gold Flame, which has got some lovely uh, red orangey leaves falling into the winter and just to have that all autumn uh, colour which is just lovely and then at the back we've got some red hot poker and we've got some hostas right here and this is going to be a lovely section and rolling into some nice geraniums at the back so this is going to in the summer come nice and big flow onto the onto the drive uh, to give us our nice country style bed now we're going to put bark on this now and uh, that's going to finish us off uh, a it will look nice, uh, but more importantly, it will keep the, uh, the weeds down and keep the flowers warm throughout the winter. So, here we have it from Euronymous to Box to Hosters. We've got a wonderful new bed. All barked up, as you can see, and uh, looking beautiful, I do think. So, if you'd like something like this in your garden, uh, give us a call. Uh, check out our website www.peacocklandscapes.co.uk uh, Love to just come in and have a look and uh, maybe you want to take our free garden audit where we can come around Have a look at your garden uh, have a chat with you see what your needs are uh, See what you'd like to do uh, in ready for next spring and we can uh, come to some arrangement of doing that either now or in the future at any time that suits you so from me, Matt Peacock, it's been great to be with you today and look forward to seeing you next week. Take care now. Bye-bye.